conformément à la résolution 57-31 de l'Assemblée générale en date du 19 novembre 2002. Je donne à présent la parole à Mr. Peter Wiedemann, Peter Wiedemann, directeur général du Centre international pour le développement des politiques migratoires. Monsieur le Président, dear Excellencies, distinguished delegates, within the mandate of my organization, we are working together with countries of origin, transit, and destination. And therefore, I want to first and foremost express my deep concerns about uh, the events of yesterday morning in Lampedusa, whereas I think that it was the worst day at the doorsteps of Europe. Ladies and gentlemen, when we last met for the high-level dialogue on international migration and development, many of us were concerned with the state of the global framework for migration. Migration and development were still perceived as separate and only vaguely related components in the global arena. For some, the issue of migration was mainly connected to security considerations and left out of the development agenda. Our understanding of the nature of international migration and the reciprocal links between migration and development were limited and policy responses unfitting. As a result of our deliberations, the continuity of discussions in the Global Forum on migration development has helped us to bridge the divide between migration as a purely domestic concern and migration as an enabler of global development. Now we find ourselves at important crossroads. The post-2015 development agenda is being framed and we should include migration in this framework in order to ensure that we seize the potential of migration to enable the de development. And this is contingent on migration being safe, humane, and orderly managed. In order to get there, we need to revisit some of the fundamentals of migration governance. First and foremost, better migration entails facilitating mobility of people for the full potential of human and social development with less red tape around immigration and with safeguards, safeguards against abuse and exploitation. Because mobility of people offers much more than fiscal and economic benefits. It is about skill transfer. It is about a global movement that brings social and cultural diversity to the places we live in. Secondly, in a mobile world, our integration frameworks need to enable participation and inclusion. Those societies that enable migrants to thrive and excel will be the most successful. Thirdly, borders will have to be managed so as to facilitate the movement of people and goods at the same time as they are needed to help reduce the risks connected to increased mobility and we need to prosecute those who exploit our endeavors of creating better migration. Ladies and gentlemen, with this in mind, we notice a growing conviction that we need dialogue that includes all stakeholders in order to have better migration. We have to include the diasporas, civil society organizations, trade unions, employer associations, businesses, or recruitment agencies and universities, to name some of them. We, as migra migration organization, will continue to give special attention to including development in our migration dialogues. And we will continue to undertake sound research to guide these dialogues and evidence-based policy making. As we know, better data and better analysis help to design better policies. We at SCMPD will continue to put our expertise at the service of the global community and to work in what we believe in, that migration is all about people, excellences. SCMPD is celebrating its 20th anniversary this year. When my organization was founded, 
the migration world look different. I hope that in 20 years from now, we can look back and know that we used this momentum to move forward. I'm sure the next time we meet, we will have seen a fundamental shift in migration governments. Let me conclude my speech by congratulating the UN General Assembly and the organizers of the high-level dialogue on international migration development and to invite us all to keep the momentum going. Through our work and most importantly, our concert that efforts to give migration a human face, we cannot miss this opportunity. Migration is development and it is too big to fail. Thank you very much. Je remercie le directeur général du Centre international pour le développement des politiques migratoires.